Here's the booth, baby. This is where it goes down. I like how they were having a green screen on. Yo, is that signed by Michael Jackson? Oh, yo, this dude met Bill Clinton. And Obama and Hillary. Ew. Is that Pelosi? Yeah, this guy's... Alright, so... Wait a minute. Basically, they decided to hang out with all these really grody, corrupt Democrats and get my picture taken with them. This is cool. In uh, shoot it up condition now. Yeah. For sure. You're going to want to tour the property yourself, uh, whether you're a contractor or you have a contractor you could bring with you. I highly recommend you guys get inside of the property, uh, tour it yourself, put together your own line-by-line -line scope of work, right? Obviously, if you're doing the work yourself, you could really reduce some of those costs. Uh, but after you get it all put together, folks, boom, $13.50 in rent. Welcome to the Investment Properties for sales show folks thing is selling at or above list we are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education we take you to the video tour won't watch tv giving it to you straight all right y'all this one whoo man i hope y'all got your work boots on for this one because this one's gonna require a lot of hard work you're gonna have to do quite a bit to get this one put back together y'all 10 3 13 pierpont avenue cleveland okay Coming to you at the low, low price, $34.9, okay? Now, market rent for this particular property, big old beast of a house, $13.50, y'all. $13.50, you're going to want to go Section 8, okay? This is a rough neighborhood. You don't go Section 8 in a neighborhood like this. You're probably going to be chasing people around for rent, doing evictions all the damn time. You don't want to do that, right? So I highly recommend you go with Section 8 here, okay? 34.9 acquisition cost, 13.50 in rent, but it ain't all sunshine and rainbows, okay? Because of course you're gonna have to do a pretty big reno, right? You're gonna have to go in, cosmetically fix this bad boy up, okay? It, you know, looking at it just from the footage, I'd say you're dropping at least like 25k on the interior cosmetic stuff. Probably dropping about 1500 on a hot water tank, 3500 on a furnace. Uh, probably going to need to do a little bit of electrical and then get it lead certified, right? So, you know, all told, you're probably somewhere in the ballpark uh, around a 50 spot, okay? Give or take, right? You're going to want to tour the property yourself, uh, whether you're a contractor or you have a contractor you could bring with you. I highly recommend you guys get inside of the property, uh, tour it yourself, put together your own line-by-line -line scope of work, right? Obviously, if you're doing the work yourself, you could really reduce some of those costs. Uh, but after you get it all put together, folks, boom, $13.50 in rent. Cleveland, Ohio is one of the cheapest real estate markets in the United States incredibly cheap housing like this is why people come from all over the country all over the world actually to invest in properties and the best thing too guys is you buy a, a rundown house like this you fix it up you could then go ahead and pull your cash out right you do a, a refinance and pull your money out right kind of pull your money out of jail okay and then you could do uh deals like this over and over and over so if you guys need lenders uh to be able to pull your money back out after you're done with this just let me know i've sold 200 million dollars worth of properties just like this one i work all throughout ohio cleveland akron Canton, Youngstown, Columbus, Cincinnati, Dayton, Toledo, you name it. I've been there uh, doing deals, so I got a huge Rolodex of lenders. So just send me an email, sales at holtonwise.com, if you want uh, me to hook you guys up with some private money, hard money uh, type lenders, lenders that will get you a traditional 30 year refi, you know, no matter what state you live in. Let me know. And then also, that's the same email you're going to want to send uh, so you can get inside the property uh, to tour it with your contractor, put together your own scope of work, right? Because uh, all the information I have for you, I've provided to you here in this video, right? I don't really have anything more detailed than this, right? Now, like, that's that's my estimate. Uh, I haven't gone in myself and spent five hours there putting together a line-by-line -line bid. If you'd like to do that, boom, I'd love for you to do that uh, so you know what you're getting into before you buy it, right? So sales at HoltonWise.com. Hit us up before 5 o'clock. I'll get you in there same day. After 5, I'll get you in there the next day. And then when you're ready to make the offer, you'll just also send that to that email address. Include your proof of funds because obviously you got to use cash to buy it up front. Um, and we will field your offer, uh, discuss with the seller, and then I'll put it under, you know, I'll draft up the contract and get you guys rocking and rolling, man. This is a big Section 8 earner. Let's roll. I like how they were having a green screen on. 
Yeah, was that signed by Michael Jackson? I was just looking. It says R.I.P. though. Oh, it's not a real signature. Let me guess. Is it because he was dead already? Wow, look at all this shit on this wall. On this piece of cardboard. This is the first piece of cardboard used in Cleveland to solicit funds on the side of the highway. It's a little known fact. It's a yo, it's Bill Clinton! Oh, yo, this dude met Bill Clinton. And Obama, and Hillary. Ew. Is that Pelosi? Yeah, this guy's... Alright, so... Wait a minute. Basically, they decided to hang out with all these really grody, corrupt Democrats and get my picture taken with them. Yo, they had a booth, bro! The Jackson... They had a booth in there! I see that. I don't know... BCO, a.k.a. Flavor... The biggest gang in Cleveland history. There's a bunch of mixes over here. If you start taking them and listening to them. There's a... There's also a pipe. There's original Xbox in the thing over here. Xbox. Yep. Shitter. There's clothes in the dryer. It does have a hot water tank. a furnace but I would guess my guess would be that these have not fired in a while <sighs> kitty litter box what we got in here weed whacker and shit here's the booth baby this is where it goes down but yeah dude there's an original xbox right here Got Halo? I don't know if it's got anything. Looks like it might looks, not work. Looks like it's been there a while. <laughs> Look how much dust there is on the controller. Yeah, that might just be Cheeto dust. Yeah. I feel like they just nope the from you. Yeah, it's a studio. It's too small for me to like get in and turn around. No, where was it? It's right here, tucked behind the furnace. I didn't see it. It's on the back wall. Oh yeah, look at that. Well, looky there. Updated electrical. <laughs> cool. All right. All right. How's the upstairs look? Uh, it's about as fucked as everywhere else. Empty. One uh, bedroom definitely has fucking water damage from the roof. Cool, upstairs. This place is a gold mine. 
treasure trove. Pencil sharpener in the window. Okay. No, at least they have one. Yeah. Oh yeah, this broom here is a beauty. Pretty good. No, this is really nice up here. I mean, I think it's hot as fuck up here in the <laughs> summer. Right? And it's a pretty cool little third floor bedroom. <laughs> oh my god, the fan! <laughs> <laughs> the fucking fan has seen better days, dude. Oh, they were nice enough to leave the decorative cover on the old chimney thing. at all if I just maybe one of those cool guy leans. Yep. Yeah. Kick it back. bathroom access or the toilet tub access we got the leaks yeah we got the leaks this place was pretty cool man Yeah, it's got a sound bar next to the fish tank, too. <laughs> they had one downstairs, too. Behind the bar. Or what would have been the bar. You think it's the owner that's like a famous rapper? Without it. Do you think this is juice or tea? I'll tell you I'm what... I'm torn, dude. Do you want to know what the flavor is before you make your guess? Yeah. White tea raspberry. Fuck. It's tea. You think so? Yeah. What's tea? It's unfortunate, dude. Dude, this house in its heyday was probably one of the nicest ones on the block. I really wish I could have seen what this looked like before it was all missing a bunch of stuff. Yep. I like the built-in stuff. 
building cabinets and whatnot. Derek, go outside. I'm guessing so. Oh, okay. Oh, I see the back porch and all that, though. Yeah, the back porch really doesn't exist, though. Yeah, it doesn't look safe. Well, there's the inside outside shot of it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.